What's up, y'all? It's Carrington, the Celebrity Barber, a.k.a. Carrington on site, or Mr. Carrington on site. Today, we are doing a bevel review. No way. No way. 50 billion didn't do it. 50 billion didn't do it. You guys are about to see what's in this box. You, you, you're going to be amazed. You are going to be amazed. I promise you. Let's open it up. A 50 billion sponsorship to Carrington on site. Y'all ready? Because I am. The bevel, the official bevel review. One of the best clippers in the world. Best clippers in the world. Okay, so it comes with a T-blade. Comes with a T-blade. Comes with a exfoliant, exfoliant toner. Also comes with a moisturizing face gel. You think I'm not gonna use it? I'm definitely gonna use it. Definitely gonna use it. Okay, 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 so we got a face wash. You definitely got a face wash in this. Let's talk about what's in the box. I'm excited. I hope you guys are. Ladies and gentlemen, don't try this at home. I feel like a kid in the candy store. I feel like a kid on Christmas. Bruh. Ooh, pretty easy. Fairly easy to open. Wow. The design of this box, the, the craftsmanship to this box is amazing. You don't see clippers like this. Let's get into the box of the Bevel Blade. So, oh, okay, so it's not, not, not too heavy, not too heavy. It's cordless, you know, definitely cordless. Definitely cordless. That's amazing. Um, looks like it's really, really well put together, for sure. You know, I've used a lot of other uh, trimmers on the market, and um, they seem kind of cheap, but this really looks like they put some hard work into it. You can stunt with this flipper. I mean, like, you can literally have this, you know, hanging from your belt buckle walking down the street. So they're gonna notice this is a bevel blade, bevel clipper. Like, this is dope. This is like having, you know, and I'm not, I'm not sizing it. It's like having a Lamborghini of clipper. I mean, they say this is the Ferrari of clippers. I mean, probably. This is the Lamborghini of clipper. So, you know, Ferrari, I'm guessing, uh, Lamborghini. Or maybe, you know, I just realized. Um, a lot of the barbers in the industry have this clipper right here. Um, but something that I just realized, and I talked about it earlier, this is innovative. This is some Elon Musk type, Tesla type stuff. Like usually with a clipper, you have to take the clipper apart and put it on a mirror and, and level it. This right here is definitely worth that 220 or $200, I mean, you sh you're gonna make that money back off of cutting, you know, cutting hair. This right here, the quickness of being able to change the sharpness, I've never seen this before. I've never seen it. This is sharp, this is not sharp. So if a kid comes in, a snotty nose kid comes in, or whatever, don't say snotty nose, a snotty nose kid comes in, you can make them dull. You can make them dull. You can put the clipper on, change it that quick, put it back on, snap, and now you're cutting the kid. And the kid's not, ow, ow, ow. These, you have to, it, it takes too long. That's, that's, that's worth the, that's worth the 220, in my opinion. You're gonna make the 220 back. Point blank, point, point blank period. Let's, 
it's it's innovative. The only thing, because I just put lotion on my hands, um, it seems like it will slip out of your hand. It does seem like that, but there's also other brands out there that I, you know, I may mention that you can put over top of uh, the clipper, and that will keep it, you know, in your hand. Um, it's um, the spec on it. It's 1.61 pounds, so it's it's not that heavy. You know, it's not the lightest of clipper, um, but it, uh, you know, it gives has enough weight where it feels like it's not just you know. You know, you're not holding a piece of paper while you're cutting. Um, yeah. Uh, so, in my opinion, I give this a, before I cut, before I'm cutting with it, based off of uh, this quality, based off of the how quiet it is, you're not going to wake up your, um, your neighbors or whatever. I give this... Uh, Eight out of ten bald head, all right? Eight out of ten bald head. Eight out of ten bald head. All right? Eight out of ten bald head. Let me, let me tell you why it's eight out of ten bald head. It's another factor that I just sat down and I thought about. You drop these, and I hate to compare things, but if you drop these, you know, you may break the, uh, the, the top part, the trimming part of the, 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 the clipper part, the cutting part. You drop these, it's kind of like crashing a Lamborghini. You know, you're gonna to have to, I, I don't even know if they sell parts of it. You might have to buy a whole new clipper. That gives it an eight out of 10, you know, definitely. Um, I wanna maybe even go 7.5 because I can see myself one day, you know, cutting and I'm doing my thing, you know, cutting Carrington on site, you know, on the side of, you know, the Grand Canyon, giving a shape up or something, or, you know, on the moon, giving a haircut. But if I drop this, um, yeah, I think that maybe, you know, you know, I, not only will you may have to buy me, you know, clipper blade to it, but you, what if you chip the front? Like, will the clipper still connect the right way? If you break here, will the lithium battery still work if you chip a piece from here? I don't know, guys. I don't know. Um, we'll see. Uh, I'm not going to say we'll see if I drop it, but we'll see over time. You know, I'll, I'll probably have to get back to you guys on that if I ever do drop it. But that gives it a 8 out of 10 ball head, 7.5 ball head. I don't know. What it One of the two. You know, everybody drops something, especially based on the fact that bevel does not come with a, you know, a, a rubber piece that keeps it firm and tight in your hands. Yeah, so if there's any other products or clippers that you guys want me to review, uh, put it in the comments below because I would, you know, would love to, you know, break things down, you know, to a T on what, you know, the industry needs. You know, I, I'm in this every day. You know, I'm using this, this these products every day. I can give you the best, you know, understanding of what's good and what's not, you know, so let me know. Let me know, uh, you know, what you guys want me to review next. You know, um, if, you, if you want to book a haircut, turn into the Celebrity Barber is my Instagram. Um, and, you know, we can go from there. You know, um, I'm, I'm really pushing on these man weave units, these, you know, the hair prosthesis, whatever you want to call, call it. Um, this is next, you know, you know, of course we love, you know, you know, my, 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 my rating system of, you know, zero to 10 bald head, but you don't have to be bald. Everybody doesn't want to be bald. Um, so, use your reference, there you go.